Nvidia is seemingly gearing up to create a super version of its RTX 3090 graphics card, which will be built using the full GA102 GPU. This super variation will have a TGP or total graphics power of 400 watts. Currently, the GeForce RTX 3090 serves as NVIDIA's flagship gaming GPU, but the green team wants to offer more power with the upcoming Super Refresh. The NVIDIA GeForce RTX 30 Super is expected to feature a full GA102 GPU core with faster clock speeds and a much larger requirement in the terms of power, as rumored by Greymon55. The GPU is based on Samsung's 8 nanometer custom process node, designed specifically for NVIDIA and features a total of 28 billion transistors. It measures in at 628 millimeters squared, which makes it the second biggest gaming GPU ever produced, right below the Turing TU102 GPU. The GeForce RTX 3090 Super will be the first gaming graphics card to feature this GPU with a total of 84 SM units that would result in a total of 10,752 CUDA cores. This would be a 2.5 increase in the core count, but the rumor also states that the graphics card will feature a TGP of 400 watts. That's 50 more watts than the existing GeForce RTX 3090, which means it could offer faster clock speeds on GPU and VRAM. The GeForce RTX 3090 also has a 24GB GDDR6 memory interface which should be retained. We could also expect a 5% performance increase, which would be in line with the previous super launches from NVIDIA. It is possible that NVIDIA could cut MSRPs on existing cards and replace them with these newer super refreshes at the same MSRP early next year. Although that doesn't seem likely as retailers are still almost completely sold out on graphics cards. NVIDIA's GeForce RTX 30 Super Series are reportedly going into production this quarter with a launch in 2022. What do you think? Will you be grabbing one of these when they release? If you can even get your hands on one? Let us know in the comments down below or go check out these awesome videos too.